As the state prepares to receive more than a million doses of the COVID-19 vaccine, the city of El Paso says we could see the first doses of vaccine in the next couple of weeks. ABC 7's Brianna Chavez is live with what we know so far about the city's plan for distribution. Brianna. Well, Eric, Stephanie, behind me is just one of four clinics where the city plans on distributing the vaccine. It's one of the many preparations that are underway, but several El Pasoans that I spoke to say they have mixed feelings about being vaccinated. This standalone clinic is one of the four buildings the city purchased. It will offer testing and distribute the vaccine once it's available. We've already purchased the uh refrigerators and the freezers. The clinics are located throughout the borderland. One clinic in the Northeast will also house a COVID-19 testing lab and will be a logistics center. Another building will be a response center for epidemiology, the task force and contact tracers. The city says it's using 37.5 million in CARES Act funding for the project. 13.2 million was used to purchase the buildings. Those four buildings that we bought were designed to be in the areas of the most vulnerable population we have. But El Pasoans have mixed feelings about the vaccine. At first, I'm probably not going to get it personally so that I can see what the effects or the side effects are first on the people that do get it, just in case there's any safety issues. And he's not alone. According to a survey from the city, out of more than 4,000 responses, 68% who said they won't get it or probably won't are afraid of the side effects. And I think I already promised that I will be first in line uh, as allowed to take the vaccine and if uh, anything happens to me then I'll take the vaccine but I don't expect any of that to happen <laughs> so I'll be the guinea pig very very gladly and these clinics are expected to be up and running by the end of this year now the city is still asking for all passwords to complete their vaccine survey they still want to know how you feel about getting vaccinated we'll be sure to have a link to it on our website kvia.com live in west el paso brianna chavez abc7 all right brianna and this is a breakdown according to the department of state health services on how many vaccines each hospital will receive university medical center will get more than 2900 doses the hospitals of Providence East Campus will receive 975. The same for the Memorial Campus, Del Sol and Las Palmas Medical Center, also both getting 975 doses each.